report on the sarcophagus, is back. Seems like it's Mayan, at least 3000 years old. What was the sarcophagus doing on the train? Beats me. The interesting part is that there's a network of magnets inside, generating a stable magnetic field. Well, it was stable until the lid was removed. Now it's too unstable. Curious. I got some news for you. My deputies were canvassing the area surrounding the crash site, and they found something. Two bodies, burned to a crisp. You mean they burned in the crash? Maybe, they're too far away, someone must have moved them, I guess. In any case, let's go have a look. Got the field coroner's report. There wasn't much left of the bodies, but the dental records identify the victims as Mark Buchanan and Joseph P. Joe and Mark, they're locals that make deliveries around the county in their pickup. So, it's a safe bet they weren't on the train. Probably arrived here after the crash to check for survivors. According to the coroner, they died from severe radiation burns. Which probably means... Oh, God. We need to call radiation control, get their men here, contain the whole place. There won't be any need for that. Section Chief Bowman, what are you doing here? You're the local sheriff, correct? Right, William Sheridan, but please, call me. I need your men to contain and catalog all the evidence from the scene. I will collect them from your office later in the day. Nobody talks to the press until we've figured out what's going on. I'll be damned, an FBI section chief, here, in Blairfield. Yeah, why are you here, sir? Senior FBI officials don't normally go in the field. This case was deemed important enough for my personal involvement. We can't have another damn fiasco. As for your fears, we are clearly dealing with something that left little to no residual radiation. Uh, that's highly unusual, what could have possibly killed these two locals? To think of it, Bill, didn't you say they have a truck? They sure do. And before you ask, no, it's not around. Sheriff put out a bolo. I want that car found. Whoever took it from the scene might be a witness. Let's get to work, people. Dale, glad I've caught you. It's not the best time, partner. No, I'm well. Apart from the fact that I've got a probe in. I know you and I go back a while, but that's oversharing. Well, don't ask questions if you don't want them to be answered, partner. Anyway, what's the emergency? Bowman's here. He showed up at the train crash site I'm investigating. He's not a field agent. What is he doing in Blairfield, Montana? My thought precisely. Something's going on. Have you heard anything back at the bureau? Well, my doc wanted a word with Bowman the other day, but his secretary said he was busy busy not away so no one at the bureau actually knows he's here this doesn't bode well bowman wouldn't make an unsanctioned visit unless yes unless what dale hello no reception you've got to be kidding me what the hell's going on here your phone's dead too looks like the whole network's down must be a tech failure at the radio tower or something good thing the walkie-talkies are still working Someone just reported a crash pickup in the town square. Could be the one we're looking for. Let's go. 